Well, these are new pepper guns that the Spokane County Sheriff's Office will now have when they answer calls. Today, the Board of County Commissioners approved the purchase of more than 200 new non-lethal options for officers to use on the street. Legislation passed earlier this year requires officers to use any non-lethal means necessary for de-escalation. Ryan Yagor gives us a first-hand look at the new non-lethal weapons. These are the new non-lethal weapons that deputies will soon be carrying, high-powered pepper ball guns. We have to be very, very creative. But at the same time, we also walked away from a few situations. New laws say law enforcement have to use any means necessary to de-escalate a situation. But Sheriff Ozzy Knezovich says those new laws also force them to stop using shotguns that shot beanbag rounds, limiting their options for non-lethal force. The Spokane County Sheriff's Office had less than 12 of these non-lethal pepper guns in their rotation. Now with this purchase, they'll have over 200. This was one of the few platforms that were that was tested and uh, the others that we looked at were really still in their developmental stage and we weren't willing to spend taxpayer money on something that was experimental. It'll cost around $160,000 to make the purchase. Training officers and I learned how to use the new tools from Joshua Sherrard, the director of law enforcement for Berna Technologies. They are very easy to use. Uh, the manual of arms is very similar to other weapon systems, so teaching somebody how to use a launcher really doesn't take a whole lot of time. It's when to use it and when it's most appropriate to use it and when it's appropriate not to use it. These new pepper guns can shoot a pepper spray filled ball from further away, which will increase the range officers have. But it still doesn't solve the problem of if we have to insert something inside Inside a house, it's, there's no guarantee that this will go through a window at certain ranges, and it also doesn't give us the capability to disperse a riot. But now, at least every unit by the end of January will have another option. In Spokane tonight, Rania Core, 4 News Now.